As one whom his mother comforts, so I will comfort you, and you will be comforted in the kingdom of heaven. Isaiah chapter 66, verse 13. Take a second and think about those words. What do they mean to you? My understanding of these words is that the love and comfort of heaven, the love of God, is like the love and comfort of your mother. The way my mother makes me feel when she tells me she loves me, when she says, I'm so proud of you, son, and when she tries to comfort me and say, it's going to be all right, son. Those are the best feelings in the world. My mother, Bridget Morris, was born December 28, 1972 and is a member of the Ho-Chunk Zanti Sioux Tribes. Today we honor this woman with the Mother's Love Award for all that she's done throughout my life to make me the man I am today. <clears throat> In all the days of my life, my mother has accomplished many things. June 30, 1993, she gave birth to me. Being her first child when she was so young, she was scared. She thought she wouldn't be able to raise me on her own. So up until the age of six, I kind of bounced back and forth between her and my grandma until my dad came around. To me, that kind of shows me that she's a loving mother. Shows me that uh, she wasn't scared to ask for help. You know, she did what she thought was best for me. <clears throat> Along with being a loving mother, my mom is very strong. In my mind, she's a very strong woman. Fast forward about nine years, my sister Miracle's born. Shortly after she's born, she becomes sick. From that illness, she ends up being hospitalized. And when that happened, up until that point, my mom and my dad, they were both kind of heavy alcoholics. They partied a lot. And then when that happened, something clicked in their head. They had a realization. So after that, they changed their ways. They stopped drinking, stopped partying. <clears throat> They started taking classes for my sister. Due to her illnesses, there were, there were going to be a lot of everyday procedures that would have to be done to help my sister survive. So my, to see my mom, to see my mom do that, commit all her time, all her strength, mentally, physically, and spiritually, to do that for my sister, showed me how strong she was, and showed me that she was a great role model. Being a great role model, she taught me right from wrong. She taught me what to say, what not to say in certain situations. And being my mom, she taught me how to respect a woman, how to treat a woman. <clears throat> and through all this, through everything she's been through, she's always had a great sense of humor. She always knew how to make me laugh, make me smile. She might not have been as funny as my dad, but she tried. No matter the situation, she could put a smile on my face. I love her for that. My mother has always been a very loving mother with great mental, physical, and spiritual strength that, brought us, that has brought a lot of inspiration to my life. This is why it is my greatest honor to present the Mother's Love Award to my mom. Now it is my pleasure to introduce your next speaker, who has slain many dragons, defeated many villains, Killed many zombies in the PlayStation world. Please welcome Kendrick Oka.